Doctor. Hello, hello, good evening. Hello, hello. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. Hi, how are you guys? Welcome.
Hello. How are you guys? Good evening, teacher. Antonio, good evening. Thank you for being here. How are you, Antonio? <clears throat> I am a little, a little sick, but I'm okay. Teacher. Pero no quiere ya también. A little sick. Pero yes. no quiere. Yes. I'm okay, teacher. Ah, okay, okay. That's that's. I'm sorry that you are uh, a little sick, but we have to continue, right? There's nothing, nothing we can do about about this. Okay. Well, welcome, Antonio. Thank you for being here. It's a pleasure to have you here again. Thanks. It's a pleasure to meet you, John. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. What about the rest? Lucy, hello, Adriana. Christopher, Christopher is sick today, or Christian? Hello. Okay. Hello, teacher. Hello, hello, guys. Gabriel also is here. All right. Guys, thank you. Thank you so much for being here. What a pleasure. Another day, another opportunity to continue practicing and improving. We're just waiting for the rest to show up. Okay. Too. There are not so many people, it's just six of us, six people only. Hold on, hold on, just trying to find some here. Got it. It's loading, okay? It's loading, it's loading. Here it is. Well, the same people <laughs> are still here. Well, Hector is here and, uh, and Holman. Okay, we are eight now. We can, we can start, we can start. And Pamela has just joined us. Excellent, thank you very much people for being here. Let's start and let me take attendance. <clears throat> uh, Maria Turcios, Adriana, Maria Turcios. Yeah. Yes, hello, hello. Thank you for being here. Yes, one no. Carlos Elivaldo Abrego Marmol. <clears throat> no, he's not here yet. Hopefully he will be here later. Christian Alexander Elevalo. He said that he was sick or he called in sick. That's... Christopher Spitia Chipawa. Present teacher. Hi, Christopher. How are you? How do you feel? I'm very good, 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 good now. <laughs> excellent, excellent, fantastic. Almost, almost. Yes. Okay, Fatima Denise Aguilar Marquez. No, Fatima, no. Gabriel Beltran Perez. <clears throat> Present teacher. Hello, Gabriel. Hector Francisco Morales. Present teacher. Hi, thank you. Isabel Hernandez Hernandez. No, not yet. Ivan Petrovich Guzman Aquino. Holman Saul Giron Sanchez. Present. Hello. Laura Yasmin Portillo Andres. Lucy Natalie Juarez de Ramirez. Present. Hello. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Nelson Antonio Rodas Rosales. Present teacher. Oscar Armando Romero Mendoza. All right. 
Pamela Carolina Molina Guevara. Present. Yes. Roberto Carlos Hernández Cruz. Rosa Lina Alvarado. <laughs> Nobody is here, right? Just eight people. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven people missing. That's a lot. A lot. Okay. Yes. Well, let's start. Let's start. Uh, thank you, guys. I thank you all for being here. I know it's difficult to be here after a long day of work. It's just hard, you know. We're tired, we're hungry, we're sleepy. We want to rest. But it's important, all right? It's important. I'm just, I'm just loading the, the presentation. Ivan just joined us. That's good, that's good. Let's keep getting more people. Okay, the presentation is ready. <clears throat> Here, let me show you. Please confirm or let me know when you see the presentation. Oh, no. Guys, do you see it? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay. We're going to start in, uh, well, there is a lot to do, a lot to talk about, and there is a lot of practice, and that's very, very important. Remember that practice makes perfection. Do you see anything? I don't see anything. I just see a black, a dark screen. Now I can see it. Excellent. Yes. Okay, look. First, let's just start with this. I have circled or have, I have a picture over here. And you see the word project in a circle or the word project in the center, all right, or in the middle. And uh, as you can see, it has some arrows. It has some arrows pointing at some words. We've got plan, we've got quality, finance, strategy, team spirit, and honesty. Guys, what do you think about this? Like a combination, what comes to your mind when you see all these words and when you see the word project? What do you think? Or what can you perceive? Hi, teacher. Yes. Uh, well, I, I think is is our points very important. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, ten, team spirit is is very important for for be a for do a, a good a good job a good a good work. Uh, mm -hmm. It's very important the attitude for for to do the, the, the work. Okay, okay, I understand, I understand. Excellent, Homer, thank you very much for that. Thank you for your opinion. Okay, I'm expecting to get more, more opinions, okay? I'm here. So tell me, what do you get or what do you think when you see all these words together and like that? Yes? I ensure that that uh, the yeah. are important to spirit. We need to have a we are gonna do 
uh, finance. I don't know how to pronounce it, but we need we need money to the project. Uh, so it's um, each one is a very important part. Okay. I don't. It was it was difficult to hear you, Pamela. I don't really know why. Probably it's your internet or my internet or the microphone. But people, did you hear her clearly? No, clear. Not clear, right? It was not clear, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. It may be my my, my internet or your internet or the or the microphone. Yes. Yeah. Okay. It's okay, but thank you, thank you very much. Uh, you, we understood some some ideas. Excellent, very good. Okay, let's continue, guys. What comes to your mind when you see all these words? Those, those are our word. Uh huh. Describe a uh, um a specific quality to to make a project successful. Successful. It's, it's very uh, each each quality is very important to 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 make win a project without uh, one of this quality maybe the project uh, uh, will 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 not will not go to implement, 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 to implement, yes, implement, yes, implement in in the, for for the company. I think, teacher. Okay. Yes. Yes. Very good. Very good, Hector. Thank you very much for your participation and your opinion. Okay, guys. What else? Anybody? No. What about what about what about adding more words or more more? Uh, how can I call this? More um, keywords. What about more key, more keywords? We got just plan, quality, strategy, team spirit, honesty, finance. What else? Would you ask? Transparency, teacher. Okay, transparency, very good. Transparency, transparency, okay. Yes, excellent. What else? Responsibility. Okay, responsibility, all right. Sponsor, responsibility, that's a perfect one. Do you have more? Communication. Communication, very, very important, highly important. Communication, yes. Okay, what else, people? No? Okay, okay. Very good, very good. That's okay, no, don't worry, don't worry. Well, we have, we have uh, in the middle of the, of the words, we have the word project, okay? And project, a project, we all, I mean, all people or all humans want their project to work, right? I want my project to work. I think, or I believe that you also want your project to work, right? Yes. So for that to be, to, for, for that to happen, we need to uh, meet, all these qualities over here, or all these terms, all of them, they have to be there. And of course, we can add more. As you were mentioning, like communication, responsibility, and transparency. Yes, good things to add, all right, in a project. Very good. Thank you guys for your participation. Yes. Using this, this uh, or, or applying or implementing all these words, we will have a very successful project. All right, look, uh, let's 
kind of review a little bit about a product survey, all right? Can anybody help me read the definition, please? <clears throat> anybody? Teacher. Yes. Can you, you can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. What is a product survey? A product survey is a tool that a company can use to learn what their user thinks about their product. Running survey before launching a product means you get to see what people really want and need. All right, all right. Thank you very much for reading, Antonio. Thank you, thank you. A product survey is a tool that a company can use to learn what their users think about their products. Running a survey before launching a, uh, a product means you get to see what people really want and see, okay? Sometimes, sometimes some products have already been launched, okay? But probably the companies or the CEOs of the companies, they want to uh, improve them or change them, I don't know. And that's why they, they run the service. All right. Now, yes. Guys, do you think the survey is important? Yes. Yes. Important? Yes, yes. Do you think do you think a survey should always be implemented? Yes. Yes, okay. All right. Maybe yes, maybe no, that's okay. Yes. Okay, let's continue. We're gonna go back and we're gonna go to the book on page number, open it on page number 20. Hold on, it's not 20, not this one, I'm in the wrong page, my apologies. <laughs> it's page 24. Okay, page 24, that one. Okay, here. Okay, I'm sharing the book with you, uh, with you guys. If you don't see it, let me know. If you don't see it, okay, yes. All right, over here in the book we got, we continue talking about products or testing products. We got the, the, the objective or the goal for today, and it's this one, I will be able to design a basic questionnaire to test a new product. Okay, that's the activity for later on. Look at the first part, let's start. Have you ever, have you ever conducted a focus group? This question is for you guys. Have you ever conducted a focus group? Anybody? Yes, teacher. I have. Okay. Can you tell us a little bit about that? I have conducted a group. Um, I work in a, in the human resources area. So we use a lot this this is strategy for to the of the employees. Uh, we well, right now we are we are making the well we are communicating the results of um how do you say clima organizacional. Come again, please. Clima organizacional. How do you say it? I have no idea. Do you I hear me? <laughs> do you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. But I don't even know. I don't even know that in Spanish. 
Oh, okay. Can I, I cannot, <clears throat> sorry. And I cannot give you the words in English because maybe it's wrong. It might be different in English, you know? Uh -huh. I, I don't know the word in English, but we make a, a climate organizational survey uh, to know the to know the the opinion of the employees, and we are communicating the the results, and we do focus group to uh, know um, the. Um, the ideas that the employees have to uh, improve the the condition of the of work, uh, how to improve the process or whatever it um, whatever it takes in the in the in in their work. <laughs> Bless you, bless you. Wow. Make some, drink some water. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Excellent, Pamela. Very good, very good. Okay, and it's it's good that you use it very often or you apply or you implement this very often. It's good, it's good. Like I have never, I have never conducted a focus group. Never. Yes. So I don't, I don't really, really, I would have problems the, the first time. Yes. <laughs> All right. To Today, today I have to conduct a focus group. Really? We are doing it right now. Yes. Oh wow, that's yes. good. That's good. <laughs> yes, and we we you have you have to create like um um a survey or questions, specific questions that you want to the people um answer and discuss in the group that's how we do it all right all right so you might you must be must be tired of, of of talking about focus groups right like <laughs> right right now yes <laughs> yes like you're doing that in the in your in your uh in the job and you're like in the classes the same thing like oh no <laughs> but we learn more that's that's true that is true that is true we never stop learning and we learn maybe just a, a, a little thing or a, something that might need might, might be insignificant but no learning is learning yes all right yes. people we continue with the same question pamela thank you very much for your opinion and for your well, actually personal opinion now look we continue with the same question have you ever conducted a focus group Another person that has done the same? No, nobody? Okay, that's okay. No, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, yes. Now, we're gonna answer, we're gonna answer this question. <clears throat> this question is a little long. It says, why do you think it is important to design good questions about the product for the participants in the focus group to respond? Let me read it again. It says, why do you think it is important to design good questions about the product for the participants in the focus group to respond? Guys, why do you think this is important? Like the questions. Why do you think good questions are important? Hello? If you have good, good answer, uh, we could uh, get good information and this informa good information is for Tomar Seria Take. Take a good decision about make. Hmm? make a good decision. Make make a good decision. Uh -huh, a good decision for for the product. Uh, we 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 need a uh, sell. Okay, okay. 
All right, that's a good opinion. That's a good opinion, Hector. Thank you very much. All right, another person. Why the good questions are important? Teacher. Yes. Uh, I think the communication is important in 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 a a team of 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 work because when you when you <clears throat> When you want uh, want to want to do a a good work in in group is the co communication is very important. Okay, okay, very good. Yes, it's it's essential, crucial, important, necessary. We continue talking about that, right? Yes. So. Tomo is saying that the communication between the company and the public should be really good. I mean, or meaning, if you have good questions, you're going to have good answers. And that's what, what Hector was saying too, okay? If you have uh, questions that are not really good, your answer is not going to be really good or it's not going to be concise. It's going to be lacking and uh, you're not going to have enough information to improve the product in the way you want it to be, right? So it's, it's very important to have these good questions. Yes. Okay, let's go down here to the second part. And it says, read the following excerpt about tips to design focus group questions. All right, there is a, a lot to read over here. I'm going to read, listen to the pronunciation. After that, we're going to we're going to check the vocabulary, okay? Yes. Let me start reading. Pay close attention to, to the pronunciation. You can help your members have a more productive session by asking questions that grab their attention and get them to provide more honest and complete responses. Number one. Introductions. Begin the session with a set of questions that will enable focus group members to get to know each other one better. Okay. Sorry, each other better. For example, their favorite hobbies and interests. What they enjoy. What they uh, sorry. What they enjoy focus groups, etc. The second one says fun starter question or activity. Ask a fun question or do a team building game to get the group's creativity flowing. For example, ask them to think of three words to describe their favorite hobby. Number three, format. When choosing a focus group or focus groups questions, be sure to, inclu to include a mix of multiple choices, choice questions to provide structure and direction and open-ended questions to allow for further exploration and discovery. Four, rating scale. Select an appropriate rating scale to measure different levels of approval. Number five. I haven't seen this word before. Specificity, I think is, I'm going to look for it. Okay, avoid vague open-ended questions that simply ask why. The word why has a negative meaning. It makes the respondent think their first answer was not good. Instead, ask respondents to provide some specific examples of what they liked or did not like about the item in question. Six, closing. Thank the participants for their help and ask if there, if there anything, if there is anything could be, no, if there, that's, that's kind of wrong. And ask if there anything could be done to improve their experience as a member of the focus group. There's something missing over here. Okay, yes. Now let's go back up over here. And guys, do you have any vocabulary questions?
What do you mean do, with the word grab, teacher? Grab, grab the attention, or like catch, catch ah. attention. Yes. Okay. But you can also use grab when you grab uh, a person's hand, you're grabbing your hand or, or grabbing an object, like grabbing an object. Yes, you can also use it like that. Thank you, teacher. Yes. Okay, more questions, people? Teacher, enable. Enable. Where is it? 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 I don't know. Oh, he... I will enable, like allow them or permit them. Okay. Yes. Allow, like allow or permit or let. Yes. Okay. That's enable. In the number five, mm -hmm. avoid vague. Yes, that one. It's, it's like, like, like the one that we have in Spanish, vago. Oh, okay. Like something that has no sense. Mm -hmm. Yes. More questions? No, we're good. Wait. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, I got this one. I was looking for it. It's difficult to pronounce. Uh -huh. I forgot it already. <laughs> Specificity, that's what it is. Specificity, all right? Yes. Specificity or specificity, all right? Specificity or specificity, all right? It's a little difficult to pronounce. Okay, let's just start. I need volunteers to start reading. Can anyone read the first part? This one. Thank you, Isabel. Please go ahead. Isabel, hello. Then, then we're going to continue with Rosa. Okay. <clears throat> yes. You can help your members have a more productive session by asking questions to grab their attention and get them to provide more honest and complete response. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Rosa, continue with the first one. No, the first one. The first one. The first one? Yes, please. Okay. Introduction. Begin the session with a set of questions that we enable focus group members to get to know each other better. First, what they enjoy focus group, etc. Okay. Thank you very much for reading, Rosa. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome. I need a volunteer for the second one. Okay. Holman, thank you very much. Go ahead. Fun starter question or activity. Ask a fun question or do a team building game to get the groups creative flowing. For example, I ask them to think of three words to describe your favorite hobby. Okay, okay, thank you very much, Holman, for reading. Thank you. Number three, format. Can it Anybody help me read format, please? Yes, Hector, thank you. And then we're going to continue with the other ones, with Christopher and Gabriel. Yes. Okay. Number three, format. 
when chosen focus, uh, sorry, when chosen focus group question, be sure to include a mix of multiple choice question to provide the structure and direction and open-ended question to allow to further exploration and discovery. Thank you very much for reading, Hector. Uh, choosing, uh, choosing, choosing. And over here, I don't remember which one was like, but it was mispronounced. Can't remember. All right. Thank you, thank you very much for your participation. Gabriel, help us please with number four, rating scales. Okay, <clears throat> number four. Rating scale selects a rating. Perdón, did Rating scale. Rating is rating. Rating is scale. Yeah. Scale select an appropriate rating scale to measure the difference different levels of approval. 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 Appropriate. 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 Appropriate rating scale to measure. measure. And then approval. All right. Mm -hmm. This one is hard to pronounce too. Appropriate. Appropriate. All right. Appropriate. 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 Thank you. Thank you very much for reading, Gabriel. Christopher, can you continue, please, with number five? Okay, five, a specificity. Avoid the open-ended question that simply asks why. The word why has a negative meaning. It makes the key respondent think their first answer was not good. Instead, ask, respond, ask respondent to provide some specific sample of what they like they like or did not like about the item in question. Perfect. Thank you very much for your participation and for reading. Excellent. Adriana, you were the last one. Closing. Closing, yes. Thank, thank the participants for their help and ask if there anything could be done to improve their experience as a member of the focus group. Okay, thank you, thank you, Arena, for reading. Yeah, that's why it was some, there, some, there, was, there was something wrong. This is not correct. It shouldn't be there. It should be thank the participants for their help and ask if, if anything could be done to improve their experience as a member of the focus group. There is not necessary, okay? Yes. That's why I was like, something is wrong. Okay, very good, very good. Now we're going to continue and we're gonna have, we're gonna have the activity and the activity is basically the one that we had yesterday, but this time we're going to do it a little different. It's this one, look. Your turn, it's part number three. All right, part number three. It says group work. Design a 10 from 10 to 12 question questionnaire to find out how the participants of a, of a focus group perceive the product you've suggested in unit number one. Remember to start uh, questions with questions to make the participants interact with each other and reduce their anxiety. Then ask questions about the specific characteristics of the product. Yes. Okay. Yes, that's how we are going to do it. That's how we're going to do it. All right. Yes. Now, we're going to do it like this. We've been talking about this application. Remember? The application that can store data or internet data that you can use later on. Well, we're going to continue talking about that. Now. Remember that you're going to make questions or a, a questionnaire, a questionnaire to find out how the participants of a focus group perceive the product you've suggested in Union One. And we've been talking about the application, so that's how we are going to do it. 
Let me show you the, the what do you call it? This thing? No. Give me a second. It's loading. Oh, excuse me, guys. I apologize. We didn't see the sample questions. Look, use a rating scale to measure the participant's satisfaction. Overall, how satisfied are you with the product? No, good, bad, good. <laughs> what is your impression? The second one, what is your impression of the product? How likely are you to purchase this product? Include open-ended questions as well. What specific pictures of the product impressed you? What pictures of the product disappointed you? Some examples, okay? Yes. Let's continue here. I'm going to show you something that we, we've been talking about, but this time we're going to like kind of presented in a formal way. Not that one, not this one, not this one. I'm sorry, I'm sharing the book again. My apologies. It's this one. Let me know when you see it, please. Do you see it now? Yes. Everybody, yes? Yes, yes sure. thank you, thank you. Okay, look, uh, I kind of made a presentation or, or a, a cover for, for the product that we've been talking about. That's the application. And I have named it, I have named it free, free Intap, all right? That's the name of it, Free Intap, which means free internet application, right? Yes. And uh, look, you have the, the, the formal uh, over here. It's an app proposal, all right, from this year. Look at this, about us. All app is, a full committer, is full committed to bring the most innovative and original apps you can find in the apps store. About the free and top. And no other app can do what free NTAP can do. It can store lots of internet data that can be used as the usual internet packages we get, uh, we constantly buy, sorry. There you go. Let me read it again, because that was not good. No other app can do what the free NTAP can do. It can store lots of internet data that can be used as the usual internet packages we constantly buy. That's the app, description of the app. And look how to use it just here. Find the app, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Look, find the app for free anywhere. Play Store, Apple Store, and in your main website, February 16th. And that's Apple is, is the company, right? Apple, like Apple, no? <laughs> yes, right? But I mean, uh, all the application, right? right? That's what I mean, it's different. I'm the manager, how is you, yes. <laughs> okay, so this is the, the you're going to do your questions or your questionnaire based on this, okay? Based on this. And as you can see, this is formal or, well, a little, right? Or I, I'm presenting it in a very formal way. So you're going to do the same with the questionnaire, okay? You're going to do as if you are presenting or doing the questionnaire right there with the people. So that means that you have to, 
uh, use Microsoft Word and do the questionnaire there in a very formal way. And your questions have to be very, uh, how can I tell you? The questions have to be very, very specific and about, about the products, okay? It's not going to be about some other things. It's going to be about the free in top, okay? About the application. Because yesterday we were doing a, a survey and I could see that there were some questions not really related to the topic. The topic was the application. And almost nobody was talking about the application. You were talking about other things. I mean, the questions were good. Yes, the questions were good, but the questions were not really, really related to the product. And today we have to take, uh, like, pay close attention to that and be careful because uh, for a questionnaire or a survey, we need really good questions. Before we start, do you have any questions? No questions? I want to share this, this uh, presentation with you through this shoot uh, here, over here, this chat. This is, it keeps giving me some problems. I just did it. I sent the, the, the presentation or the, the Word document through here, through this chat. Do you see it? No? In the Zoom chat. Yes, Wait, teacher. If it is possible, uh, can you share that with the with everybody else in the, in the chat, in uh, the WhatsApp chat, please. Yes. I think it is easier for us to be, or to get the, the, the document from WhatsApp. It's easier, more accessible. Please, if you can do it. I could do it, but my, my uh, WhatsApp web is very slow. <laughs> And I know my computer will get stuck and I don't want that to happen. Okay. All right. And then I'm going to make the groups, but I need, I need to see that in the group right now. If you cannot do it, I'll have to do it then. Let me open what's up over here. And I will share it with you. Loading. This will take a minute, hold on. This is very slow. It's really, really slow. Teacher. Yes? Uh, I can't open the, 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 the file. He said me they have damage. Okay, then uh, Fatima just did it in the Zoom chat. Let's oh. try to open it. Let's try to open that one. Let me see if I can open it here in my cell phone. Yeah, I can see it. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. We didn't see that. We didn't read the, the last part. I apologize. I completely forgot about that part. Down there is a, it's a short description. It's two pages. If you continue reading after the final part, after my name is John, you can continue going down there and you will see another another uh, paragraph. Yes, but I'm gonna show it to you because it's important, the information. So everybody can see it. I told you my computer is frozen. Can you see the, the document that, that uh, Fatima shared? Can you open it? 
Let me know, please. This part down here, we didn't read this part. I'm sorry, I apologize. I skipped it. Look, the free, let me read it. You know what? No, I'm going to, it's just that you cannot use it. That's kind of weird. Okay, I don't know what's up. Uh, let me see. Lucy, hello, are you there? Can you help us read? Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, help us read, please. Free, the free internet application is out there. The app was launched five months ago. It has received plenty of reviews from lots of different people. It has been downloaded and used more than um, 11, I don't remember. And I, think um, I, and I think I made a mistake here too. It's it's eleven thousand. Sorry. Eleven thousand. <laughs> ah, eleven thousand two hundred thirty one. Mm -hmm. um, thanks. We have not gotten the comments and review we have estimated. We do not trust the comments we find in platform platform signs. Since it it may be the competition competition trying to sabotage the ground of the app, we have decided to run a survey. We have considered that there will be some people that have not learned about the app yet, so we are more than ready for that. Besides, it will help our company get more recognition. Okay, there you go. And we go over here. <laughs> Our innovation is original. Sorry. And it says here the success of this. Uh, excuse me. The success of this new app will depend on the questions we take into account in the survey. In this case, questionnaire. Okay, not survey. Questionnaire. So well-made questions are essential in order to get enough feedback to make the necessary improvement and improvements and changes, okay? So we have to do well-made questions, okay? We have to get these well-made questions. All right, now we can continue. Uh, can you use the document, people? Because somebody told me that that was not possible. Can you use it now? Can you open it? Hello? I can open. Okay. Let me share it again. I'm sending it. I just did it, all right? Okay, now I'm going to make the groups. People work, okay? I'm going to be helping you with the questions and with the vocabulary and the mistakes that you will possibly make. All right, let's go. I'll be seeing you soon, okay? Start working.
Thank <laughs> you. 